On their necks, not letting up. Okay. Okay. How you doing, bro? So I'm good, man. How are you feeling? Feeling good, man. We've got a strong team out today. Obviously, had to bring some players in. Yeah, complacency kicking in. So we've got to show that if, if you're not playing to a certain level, we brought in Jack, Tingy, lefty back. So yeah, man. The viewers are gonna like this one today. Oh, go on. Nah, good. That for me. Huh? That for yeah, me. Cool, man. Thank you, man. In a party, it ain't be over. It does the job, innit? We understand what it takes to be successful. You're not gonna be famous, just give it up. He's made our oh, style is so bright this season. He's gotta be Bradtastic, he's all over the paint. They love it, what they do for grassroots football. Before I even ask for score predictions, do you guys know the lineup today? Saying yeah. it. You've yeah. seen it? Uh, yeah, saying it. Day decent. Unreal. Yeah, day day decent line up there. Thank you for your wisdom, your guidance, and your leadership. So guys, you've seen the starting lineup. Yeah. What is your score prediction going to be today? And I need to know the goal scorers. Brad Hattrick, Oz Hattrick, Dino Hattrick, um, Lefty, Nutmeg, Rainbow Fleck. Dino Hattrick, Brad 2, King 1. Messi thanks the G for turning up to the boys' presentation like he said he would. Mass really? Massive respect. Thank you very much from Sockham Tigers. Thank you. What's happened? No one else is here. Well, we was on time though. Okay. No, they're all in there. I, I'm not the window. Because they're asking for 3 0. Oh, it's alright, man. We got Cox and Dino for a <laughs> They've got fucking Cox! These men all say that you're 3 0 head start, man. What's your play? We need it all day. They need it. <laughs> nah, this, this team beat us, you know. <laughs> you, know you can't, you can't forget they beat us, but you know. Revenge. Got bread as well. Where are you going, man? There was a boot today. There was a boot today. Give it a couple of days and I'll see you it on our own. Okay. They've ordered it minutes ago. You literally ordered it. Minutes ago. We're going to deliver it to you. We're not going to tell you who. So keep watching the snap. Listen, this is how we're going to play, yeah? So Lefty's going to be at the, um, at the back. In, like controlling at the back. Tox, you're going to be with him, but more just in front. Help Lefty, don't leave him by himself. But I want to dominate the whole possession. I don't want you to follow a man all the way there, just pass him on to Jack. Even if Jack has two on him, you can talk to Jack, press on one, because I want to I want to squeeze them back, back, back. And if they come here, we have to be tight and get that ball, and I just want to have the ball. And when they have the ball, we need to be on them, like breathe down their necks so they don't, their necks. So they don't have no position. I'm not going to lie, the last two weeks ain't been good. I'll be honest with you, it's not been good. But it comes from me, I've been late and it's just been a bit unorganised. But let's get on it boys, come on man, let's get on it. Hands on the right hand in. One, two, three, done! I thought you were saying like this. Me, like me and Oz going to be on the sideline doing tactics, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm being real, I don't like them. Four cool predictions quickly. 7-2 uh, to the Dons. 8-4 Dons. 3-0. 3-0, yeah? Fantastic to the score more. Yeah? yeah? I'm going to go splash. Splash, yeah? yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm joking. Oh, the Dons are going to win, obviously. Come on. Yeah. How about you? What's that, bro? He ain't got a clue, man. I ain't got a clue, bro. See <laughs> you for the view. What about you, Kenny? Got a remaining partial, mate. You know this. <laughs> this, is, this is the biggest game of your lives. The biggest game of the season. I'm here to tell you something. It's not gentlemen. This game is big because we're in it. It's not big because of who we're playing. We play a big game every single week. We play the pressure every single week. The difference about today is people are expecting us to lose. You've got to relish that. Let's fucking go. Let's go, go. So before we get started, I want to welcome everyone back finally to Wicked Wednesdays. We've missed it just as much as you have. The truth is the season ended, the boys went away on a holiday and we had a lot of things that came up. 
which means we can't turn the content around in time, but we're finally back. We're not going nowhere, we're back to a full schedule. So we're here every Wednesday. So everyone who's been following us on Wicked Wednesdays know that we've won the league three seasons back to back and we're now pushing for a fourth retained title. Tonight's episode is week number two of the season. So there is no league table to show you, but I can show you the results from the first week if you've forgotten them. So we beat ABFC 11-5. DUA beat Splash 6-3 and UTR beat Sirius FC 11-4. Tonight's opponents, we've got Splash. So let's get into it, Chris. Okay, what's happening, people? Welcome back to another episode of SC Don's Wicked Wednesdays, episode 20. We're finally back. Midweek Fiverr side is here. And as always, the like count is 5,000 likes. So now's the chance to do it. Pause the video, like it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And let's get straight into it. Now today's episode is a real special lineup. This is really death row. We've got Dino alongside Brad Tastic. We've got Tox, Kingy, Lefty, Ten Hag, and obviously the goal chipper left in goal. So I'm expecting a, a real fireworks and splash a no push over Riva, so it's always a tough game. Anyway, that's a foul early doors. Two minutes 40, still the early sparring. Dino picks out Lefty. Brad dropping deep to try and offer an option, but he picks out Tox. Never afraid to go one on one, quick feet beats his man, strikes, comes off the throat of the goalkeeper, gets there first and van, Bradtastic. And it must be Dino that he's looking for. <laughs> Dino! Is it me you're looking for? Remember the last time Dino played fives and you was on the pitch? Oh, bro. <laughs> the streets, fam. That's what the episode the was called, the streets. The streets. Go, go! So a strong start from the Dons, 1-0 up, Dino of all people, then Brad Tastic nearly punishes a mistake. Yeah, yeah but you're trying to get um, four, huh? four titles now, aren't you? Hey, listen, we're getting a banner at basically goals because you won it three times in a row. If you get five, you get a goal, you get a bronze bronze trophy, don't you? Leg you legacy trophy. You heard it here. You're going to get a banner, yeah? Sign up, sign up to basically Heath goals, who can stop us? And I echo what Ten Hag says, sign up to goals, Bexley Heath. Who can stop us? We've done it three seasons in a row. We're pushing for the fourth. And it's a tough league as well. Dino collects and turns, goes for the toe punt. Narrowly wide. Seven minutes in, Splash driving forward now. And I've always said it about Splash. They're a confusing side because I really rate them. I think they're very good. They've got really good technical, skillful players. But they struggle to stay up. So it's a weird one. But they come close again here. Good save from Triple F. If you drop your bag in mud, it'd probably be a dirty bag. Talking of dirty bags. Fantastic. Yeah, I'm just Ooh. a teenager. Hey, Brad, did you mean to do that? Baby, you mean to do that? Listen to our game, baby, with me. Hello, I'm the camera. <laughs> so, 2 0 up inside 10. Have you ever seen a human starfish? Well, look at Triple F. Hey, hey, hey. Hey. 9.35, still 2-0 for the Dons. Dino driving towards his man, goes for the toe punt. It's a cheeky one, it usually works. Great feet there from uh, Brad Tastic. It comes out to Tox. He's always like a magnet, the human magnet they're calling him. He just keeps the ball with him, they can't get off him. And then he eventually wins a foul in front of... I've got nothing left! I've got nothing left! <laughs> Double change for the Dons. Ten Hag and Kingy on, Tastic and Tox off. It's so wonderful to see the legend Dino slowly returning, such an elegant footballer. Nothing can ever distract him. Unless it's Chris. Dino, you're right. You blow him. You blow him. You're blaming me now. <laughs> you're blaming me for that. I see, the, I see the LV bag still, man. What was it? What are you saying? Caretaker, caretaker uh, gaffer gets nah. you those things. I borrowed it off from Lefty. No, 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 no. I borrowed it from Lefty. <laughs> now, to be fair to Chris, he's an old school masculine man. He takes accountability. He's put his hands up for that one. It weren't really on Dino. He distracted him. Anyway, we got the boy Kingy, the gaffer, come down to bless us with his presence today at the fives. And here he is now. He gets barged off the ball and. 2 2. I'm being real, I don't like them. I don't like no one over there. You're getting right here. Yeah. Good bet, are you? So, 30 minutes on Bernard's watch. 2-2. Uh, two, two. Close game at the moment. King collects it though, turns his man well. He looks in front of him, he's got Ten Hag to his left. Picks him out. Good shot. A great save from the keeper. Oh, 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 
Stay high, stay high. So 13-26, real even game, could go either way at the moment. Great feet there from Blue Shorts to be fair to him. Knocks it over to Splashes, Bruno Fernandez gives it back to Blue Shorts, switches play. Great touch, uh, not, not so good on the finish. Dino keeps it alive and finds Ten Hag. He's got his pop with him. Yeah. Well done, Oz. Better, better, saying Donny Jones. They are, right, I'm not happy, but I'm here. That. Oz. Oh, So 3-2 up now for the Dons, Blue Shorts collects it though, releases Fernandez, he looks to cut inside, uh, easy for Triple F as he rolls it out to Ten Hag, takes it on the spin, nice bit of footwork, releases Dino, good save for their keeper too. 1945, about 15 seconds shy of the half time whistle, Dons still one up, we'll take that into half time, regroup and push again for the next 20, Tox closes down his man though and collects the ball and knocks it back to King who sets us up on a path, a new path. Yeah. Fucking go and destroy them. So the half time whistle about to blow SC Don's four, splash two. I believe it's secure the bag of I'm not gonna call it from now on, bro. And she wants to obviously do the business tonight, yeah. Plus your players, the ball will come to you. If the ball don't come, you got Frankie here, or if you see it's tight, we react, or you got the front man, or lefty can have a wait for it, suck him in, pause, and then drive. Do you know what I'm saying? 1v1 player, 1v1 player, 1v1 player, 1v1 player. <coughs> There's about six of us here that's 1v1 players. The way that they defended us, they're leaving us 1v1. One one. Nine times out of ten, he will score. I might miss a two or three, but as a ten, I might score seven. <laughs> when you're 1v1s off the ball, we'll be fine. Yeah. On the ball, you can't really coach it here, like everyone knows what they should be doing. Off the ball, just work hard in it. It's 5-2, don't let them get into this game. Don't let them think that they can win the game. they got two influential players. The next 10-5 minutes is key. Let's kill the game off. Don't let them get the first goal to make it 5-3. Right. One, two, three, done! Let's go, boys. The SC Don shop is alive and kicking, but I'm going to give you some golden inside information. If you want to get some merch on a bargain, Head over to scdons.com and go to the clearance page. Have a look through and grab what you need. Also, remember it's summer. Some of you might have receding hairlines like some of the players at the Dons. We've got plenty of hats available. Also, if you haven't got your Valhalla shirt, there's no excuse. Go and grab it now. SC Dons is the club we love. Thank you for your support. So, second half begins. 19 minutes to go. Triple F takes one in the gulag. Well done, Frank. Good boy. Turn. Turn! Don't turn it into a game of pinball. Keep it. What's all this talk about pinball? The streets are talking about the dirt bag. One v one's gonna be on the opposite of that guy. Let's make a night. You won't remember. I'll be the one. You won't forget. So five two, perfect start to the second half. Triple S probably sitting at home watching this with his girlfriend. Frank, unlucky, unlucky, unlucky. We cannot accept that. So, 5-3, Splash keeping themselves in this game. That's what fives is like, guys. You know, you can score one and straight away you can concede anyway. It's good pressing from the Dons. Ten Hag looks up, picks out uh, Tox. He's got a few people around him. He must be looking for Dino. Oh, finish. Oh, I love that. <laughs> hey, what up, boys? Is it me you looking for? What an impact. So, 6-3 to the Dons, free goal advantage recouped. Lefty's probably sitting at home with his missus watching this. Come on. Yeah. Lefty, you're right. Lefty, you're right. So, 6-4, as I said, game is alive. Fantastic double step over, beats his man, lets it fly. Good save from the keeper, parries it out to his defender, who drives forward. Little kind of ball roll of his own to be fair. Tox collects it though, he's got an uh, easy pass with his triple left. Instead he picks out Dino, takes it on the turn, lets it go, just comes off the post. Reaction, reaction Dino. I'll be honest, he's the future of the club. If Ronaldinho was born in Mason and got kicked out of four secondary schools, he'd be calling in the teenage dirtbag. Dirtbag! It's going down, I'm young and Simba, you better move. You better dance, let's make a night. 
It changes perfectly. Remember, I'll be the one you won't forget. Oh, hello, from the camera. <laughs> so, 7 4 to the Dons. Brad Tastic at it again. Great feet from him, as always. Um, triple left, then good save. That's a better save than it looks. Blue Shorts collects it. Dirtbag comes in for the tackle. Splash managed to keep possession. And then there's two footballs on the pitch. And has to start it up again. 28 55. Time seems to be going very slow at the moment for Splash. Uh, Dons with our foots on their necks, not letting up. Uh, Blue Shorts collects it. Knocks it forward to Brad Tastic. Finds Dino. You know how that poem ends. Hello. Wait, Dino. Is it me you're looking for? I can see it in your eyes. I can see it in your smile. So, 8 4 to the Dons, 4 goal lead. Looking at being two wins in two as we push for our fourth title. Here's one for Triple F. That's late to see. Jack. Just a bit, a bit more. It's a bit more there. So you chose the one that weren't running? I press one then, press the other. Wait, wait, start talking. Wait, start talking with each other, come on. Quick change, tox off, Kingy on. So 8-5, more from Dino attacking their defence, but there's three men around him, and eventually they pressure him and pick his nose. Lefty's there though to do the dirty work as he collects it back. Kingy drives forward, gives away the ball again, and this guy drives forward himself, and yeah. Oi! Don's family on the sideline, unimpressed. So 8-6 with about 6 left to go, dare I say it. Splash smelling blood. But if we're going to start talking about blood, we've got to talk about new blood. Bradtastic. Teenage dirt, man. Oh my god! Demon. This boy's a demon. This boy's a demon. Brad, I need one. When I need one, I call Brad. Yeah, she cried. You know like, you know, like who wants to be a millionaire? They say phone a friend. You well, I'm from, I found him, Brad. Why are you really crying? Listen to our game played in, baby, with me. We can't afford to lose it. Now, I've seen many clips of Chris playing football and people saying that he can't play football. Fantastic, disagrees. He say well played. Yeah, I love that. Chris, Puma. Oh. <laughs> So 9-6 up, punters on the sideline discussing who you'd rather play against, Brad or Tox? Comment below, who's more dangerous? <laughs> I don't like playing against him. He's horrible. I'd rather play against Brad than Tox, I'd be wrong. Yeah. Tox is... Tox, Tox you can't even kick. Even Brad, you can, throw, Brad yeah. you can at least, he's there to be kicked. Yeah. Watch, watching them's mad bro, it's a joy, you know that. Long, you fucking joy to watch them. You see Brad here, yeah? Brad is here. You know what's mad? Jude brought it in today. Yeah. The guy, the guy was passing out. Like, couldn't believe what he was watching. Yeah, he was sending me bare shit. Could not believe what he was watching. Easy. I wish you're like the Phil Jones or the Fires. No, that's one thing. Yeah, that part of the episode again. Chris talking to the ref. Hey ref, blow the whistle. My blood pressure can't take it. Oh. So with a full time whistle about to go, Wicked Wednesdays returns with another victory for the Dons. That's two in two. And I'm gonna keep speaking it. You've heard me say it, but I'm gonna keep saying it. Uh, we're pushing for that fourth title in a row. Can we do it? If we do five in a row, we get a bronze medal. We gotta do the full first. Anyway, some more results from around the league. So obviously, SC Dons 10, Splash United 6, UTR absolutely smoking AB 17 2. That's good for their goal difference, and DUA getting a 6 3 win over Sirius FC. So the league table looks as such. Still early doors, so I can't really read into it too much. Us, UTR, and DUA all 100% win records, but UTR have got a very good goal advantage, so we've got to make sure we can catch up somehow. Next week's episode is UTR, so that's a big one early doors. So I'll see you next week for more of that. If you haven't done so already, remember, make sure you like the video. We're looking for 5,000 likes for the return of Wicked Wednesdays. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you Sunday for the X1's Cup run. And then next Wednesday for UTR. Yeah, What's your thoughts on that yeah, performance? Doing, Great game. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Done the match. Gone to the match. Uh, nobody really. It was everyone. Everyone, everyone, yeah. put, everyone put their hearts in and everyone played well. Anything. What was your thoughts on the game? 
play really well as the teams that I Um, I think Mala Munch goes to everyone. Everyone, yeah? Yeah, we deserved it today. Yeah, what about you? Everyone as well. Um, uh, well, actually, no. I'll give it to Triple Wear because he pulled off some fantastic saves. Oh, it's a decent game, mate. Decent game. Lovely to see Dino in there. His footwork is unreal. Uh, when you say king of the fives, he's a contender, mate, I'm telling you. Dino, yeah? Massively, massively, yeah. Come below, come below, you're, you're king of the fives. There's, there's four Dino, Scotty, Dolbos, Oz, and Brad. That's five. Five. Brad, going to be king of the fives. Ronaldo, next two weeks, yeah? Like, we're not here yet. Like, all we ask <laughs> is give it, give it everything. <coughs> Don't take the piss because we're not here. And respect the badge. Yo, I'm here, you know. They can't get the pitch. No, I know, I know, but I'm saying, like, as in, you know what I'm trying to say, like, as in, everyone that's on the pitch, don't take the piss, man. Because we, 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 three seasons, we, we've done it, and it, I'll be real with you. If you lose two games, it's hard to come back from. Or one game. We don't, we don't slip up. Brad's outside with the young Brad, boys. Yeah, yes, Brad. You come, come around, take the picture, bro. <laughs> Death row, you know. Chris, there's, there's two things that a man shouldn't be ashamed of. His faith and his ambitions, yeah? You see this club, we're ambitious. Some people will say, ah, oh, it's just a Sunday League football team. That's not our mentality, do you understand? It can be Sunday League, it can be cage, it can be fives, it could be anything. Our mentality is the reason we've built a family worldwide, because they believe in our message. They believe that you can come from the bottom and create something. And that's the energy and the confidence that we put out and that's why I'm devastated. Because I think that we've let the family down this year. I think the manner in which we've been losing games on a Sunday these past three, four weeks, this, since we come out the Nationals, I'm embarrassed by it. Yeah, And I apologise to the supporters because we've let them down. Because we give them a message of fighting to the death, longest 90, running till the whistle goes and we haven't been doing that. So I'm asking them to trust the process. Trust that we analyse and recognise that we have lost that edge, yeah? And believe me, it will be back next season. There's gonna be some big changes, trust me. Do you understand? Yeah? So thank you to all the supporters. Sorry that we've let you down, because Chris, remember they, they support us, which means they also get criticized. They get people laughing at them, why do you support the Dons? Oh, are you a fan of the Dons? Do you understand? They're, they're putting their, their name out there as well when they're walking around in their Don shirts, and we've let them down this year. We gave them one trophy, we should have given them another one, but we didn't. And that's why I love the fives. You see at the fives, we've won three titles back to back because we're ruthless. We don't get bored of winning. We, we don't find it cringy to want to win at the fives. Do you understand? There's no egos here. Yeah, so I wanted to, I wanted to say that. I wanted to apologise to the people, man. We should have given you more than the Plump said Cup. Thank you for sticking with us. We didn't deserve to win the league this year. And where I come from, bro, you only get what you earn. We didn't earn that league title. SC Dons, I love this club. I ain't even wearing a shirt, I got to tap it. I love this club, I love my brothers. Yeah, and we're gonna come back. It'll, it'll be different, trust me. We got Oz Ten Hag, man, in Ten Hag we trust. What? Insane. Good? Insane. One of the Dons, yeah? What's going on? Are you got Dons supporters or what? Yeah, or what? of course. Yeah? Put them on camera, Chris, man. This is the future of the club. What's your name? Ollie. Ollie. I know Ollie. Ollie. I know Ollie. What's your name, young man? Denny. Huh? Denny. 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 Oh, Philly. Philly. Patrick. Patrick. Future of the club. Anything is possible when you work hard, boys. You know that, right? SC Dons. SC Dons. Big G's Young Academy. <laughs> Do you not know about Big G? The goalkeeper. There you go. Future of the club. Believe when you work hard, it's possible. What you got? Anything for the Dons. Anything for the Dons. Anything. Why these nerds all screaming out, gang? gang. My shooters like United don't sleep on them, they ten go bang. I was in Rio with Gio, found me a wife with a golden tan. I'm the kid with a golden plan, came from the trap, it was cold and damp. Now I'm in Park Row with dams. London City 